the last decade, Hollywood has witnessed the emergence of a few black stars who attract large audiences, black and white alike. It is possible for an important star like Sidney Poitier to be seen as an actor, rather than as a black actor. You're implying that there was uh, something wrong by my not, by, by not being nominated. Well, I, there, there seems to be a lot of talk in the industry. Apparently no one has really heard from you. What are your feelings about that? I was rather delighted not to have to sit in that auditorium tonight and wind up one of the four losers. Outside of Hollywood, it's a different matter. Sidney Poitier's professional work is too often forgotten. The questions are too sharply focused. He is simply black. Mr. Poitier is not one to let this go unchallenged. How close has my association been in the past with Dr. King? For some years now, I've worked uh, raising funds for Dr. King because I uh, believe still very strongly in his non-violent philosophy. What do you feel Rap Brown's purpose is now? I figured that question would come. <laughs> I am not familiar with all of Mr. Brown's methods, except that Mr. Brown suggests violence. Well, I am, as uh, by definition, in opposition to violence, particularly violence for violence's sake. Do you think the urban riots have affected you, though? I would say that the urban riots have had effects in uh, every corner of the country and in every arena of life. Do you feel he's creating? Uh, I would like to ask you a question. Why is it that you guys are hounds for bad news? Why is it that, uh, you know, it seems to me that at this moment, this day, you could ask me many questions about many positive and wonderful things that are happening in this country. But we gather here to pay court to sensationalism. We gather here to pay court to negativism you guys have a job to do. Uh, I'm a relatively intelligent man. There are many aspects to my personality that you can explore, I think, uh, very uh, constructively. But you sit here and ask me such one-dimensional questions about a very tiny area of our lives. You ask me questions that fall continually within the negroness of my life. You ask me questions that pertain to the narrow scope of the summer riots. I am artist, man, American, contemporary. I am an awful lot of things, so I wish you would uh, pay me the respect due and not simply ask me about those things. <laughs>